Richie Blackmore, for my money, is one of the greats of rock music. I put him above Eric Clapton. I put him in consistency above Jimmy Page. And I put him on a level with Jeff Beck. If we're talking about the Holy Trinity, the Yardbirds Holy Trinity, Beck, Clapton, Page, then you, you are talking about three men. Well, Beck, Beck is the guitarist, guitarist, and I think Blackmore has as much technical ability as Jeff Beck. Eric Clapton really was the feel motivator in the 60s and early 70s, but what's he done in 40 years of any worth? And while Jimmy Page created so much with Led Zeppelin that was inspirational, again, what's he done since Led Zeppelin ended in 1979-80, well, 79 being the last album? Whereas Blackmore has been more consistent, he's gone on, and every step of his career has had so, so much that's inspirational. He's a unique guitarist, a guitarist who you can feel has emotion in his playing and technical ability. You understand and appreciate the fact that he knows and understands melody. But above all else, perhaps, with, with Blackmore, is the fact that he understands when not to play. Too many guitarists overplay or underplay. He plays right on the money and leaves enough space to allow the music to breathe and the listener to become enveloped in the whole atmosphere of what's being performed and created and generated. I don't think that's his greatest gift.